Yeah, I'm based up at the University of Auckland's uh, Marine Station up at Lee. Uh, it's located on the um, coast adjacent to New Zealand's oldest marine reserve, which was established in 1975. And when the laboratory was established, they um, started taking long-term, taking measurements of water temperature every day. So this now provides a near 50-year record of um, water temperature. And really what's quite interesting with the Lee time series compared to other sort of um, analogous records from around the world is there hasn't been any warming. Comparing it with um, another time series from southern New Zealand, from the Portobello Marine Laboratory, which is the University of Otago's laboratory, and down there you've actually seen quite a substantial warming. And so instead of the currents following their usual paths, effectively um, we've seen more water pushed down into the warmer water down into the Tasman Sea. The general expectation, I guess, is that species, as the water warms up, will move further south, you know, with um, sort of poleward extension of, of species. Um, warmer water species more warming, moving down to cold water, but what you can sort of see here is it's not, it's not uniform at all. We're, you know, little, very little warming over 50 years in northern New Zealand, um, but quite a lot of warming. Um, about a degree, winter time temperatures have increased by about a degree um, around Otago over the last 60 years, which is um, quite, it doesn't, perhaps doesn't sound like a lot, but it, it's analogous to some of the sort of faster rates of warming um, around the world.